There's no doubt about for me that enabling HDR in a game is a game changer and enabling Nvidia's RTX HDR in Wukong is just wow and yes even there are some issues it is still much much better than SDR. My master, <laughs> safe. The scriptures, sound. All I ever wanted was a life in my mountain, free from you and your so-called merits. Those high above don't trust me. I understand that. And they send you and those knuckleheads to threaten me. To obey and serve once more. <laughs> I understand that too. But what I don't understand is... You bastards killing my kind! <laughs> Just any monkey. He's a monkey of merit. A monkey was made Buddha once. None other than me can challenge him to a duel. Look, monkey. I don't make a habit of fighting someone I've bested before. Here's my offer. If you lose, I'll take you to the Celestial Court. They will stay and level your mountain. But if I lose, I shall certainly take revenge, and they will level your mountain nonetheless. Hmm. How tragic would that be, huh? You are one of the court. We don't need to resort to violence. How about you bend the knees, admit the wrongs, and we can put this behind us? <laughs> All these years, except for that pig, you're the one who talks the tallest tales. Good, I am entertained. Speaking of entertainment, wouldn't it be fun if I pluck your extra eye out for my snack and allow you to keep the other two? Because I'd hate to let you miss how I'll slaughter each mongrel of the court. Those below 
Those above, and that black mutt of yours. Come at me, all of you. Hello my friends and welcome back to my channel. I'm very excited to actually yeah, show you NVIDIA's RTX HDR in this game because it is really fantastic. Such a big difference compared to SDR. And yes, again, I mentioned it already, there are some issues with this NVIDIA RTX HDR implementation, but we're going to talk about this. But believe me, it is worse, okay, to enable HDR in this game with NVIDIA's RTX, okay? Um, I know that we're losing some frames and I haven't done any testing um, according or re regarding to this, uh, but I, I really don't care because the difference in regards of HDR versus SDR I think is worth a couple of frames in my opinion, okay? So let's talk about how to get NVIDIA's RTX HDR working on your PC. And all what you have to do is actually you add a new program to the NVIDIA app and then you look for the EXE file from Wukong and then you open the EXE file and yeah, you can enable NVIDIA's RTX HDR even the NVIDIA app is telling you it's not supported. And when you have done this you just open up the game, you load into a safe game and then you press ALT F3 and you go on the profile selector, you go to none and then immediately back to number one. And then you should have NVIDIA's RTX HDR enabled. And if it doesn't work, then just restart your computer, restart your PC. And also what you need to keep in mind is you can't or you have to disconnect a second monitor, okay? So it doesn't work with a second monitor connected. So now let's talk about the yeah, implementation about Let's talk about HDR. So, and I told you already in the very beginning, it's not perfect. It's actually far from perfect. So first of all, the main issue what I have with NVIDIA's RTX HDR is, is not really the, the loss of frames, which is a, a problem, but it's not that. It's actually that the maximum peak brightness is still limited to 1000 nits, which is fine for the LG G2, but for other TVs a little bit too less. And in this particular case, in this particular game, we have also, or on top, we have the issue with the HDR black level floor because we have actually a raised HDR black level floor very similar to the SDR picture because if you remember I made a video about this game already about the missing HDR and I actually mentioned that the SDR picture has also slightly raised blacks. So my only recommendation is actually in regards of the HDR black level raise make sure that the in-game brightness, the brightness setting in the game is set to zero. Yes, absolutely zero. Make sure it's set to zero because then you have the yeah, lowest HDR black level raise. But again, it's up to you. If you like to have a slightly different setting in regards of the brightness setting, then just go for it. But you're not adding more information. Actually, you lose information the higher you set this value. So again, my recommendation is actually zero. And we're just hoping that at some point the HDR, or we have to say like that, that we have a fix for the SDR black level floor because then the HDR black level floor with the NVIDIA RTX HDR option would also be much better. Okay, my friends, so that's it for this very quick video and I hope you had fun. I hope you like it. So make sure you like, share and subscribe. And as always, uh, give YouTube a couple of hours because this video is recorded in HDR, but YouTube can take up to 48 hours before they actually, you know, before HDR is available. And I don't have that much time because I like to get this info out to you as soon as possible. Thank you very much for watching me. I see you guys next time. Bye.